Hey guys and welcome back to a new tutorial video. So this is targeting, this tutorial is targeting the AI content editor menu. So here you will be able to automatically edit posts which are published, drafted or set as pending on your website. So this post can be manually created or automatically created. The AI Medic plugin will process any type of posts which are created also you will have the ability to edit automatically posts which are already existing on your site so if you have multiple posts on your site already published you can go to manual content editing settings and you will be able to run uh, editing on multiple posts based on the settings you set up here also the automatic part of the plugin which processes published drafted or pending post can be set up here in the automatic content editing settings but in this video i will cover each part of this also you will be able to select what exactly you want to do when editing posts in the editing templates and options tab so here you can enable ai rewriting of content which will edit the content and make it unique or translate it or fix grammar in it or anything that you wish also you can generate a featured image for posts or so you can add some ai generated content to the beginning or the end of the posts you can automatically add internal links to posts automatically add comments to posts and also automatically generate CEO description for posts. After the processing is finished, you can change the post status to what you wish. So for example, if you are processing draft posts, you can automatically publish them after the editing is complete. Also here in advanced AI API settings, you will have some advanced settings for the AI API and you can set temperature, top P and you can select the model which will be used when editing the content so this is for advanced users i will be covering in this tutorial the other tabs so i will also recommend that you check this settings field from advanced ai api settings but only if you know what you are doing uh, you can switch to gpt4 for example if you have access but keep in mind this will work out of the box right away and just fine so if you don't need to edit this then we can start and uh, let me show you how to use the automatic content editing to edit for example publish posts automatically so here we can set automatic process automatically process posts when they are published and be sure to check the enable post automatic editing checkbox here this switch and set it to on also you can set a delay for article editing if you want to delay article editing by a couple of seconds after they are published you can set here a number of seconds and here you can filter what post types you wish to automatically edit so i recommend that you disable custom post types and pages if you want to automatically edit only posts and if you want to edit custom post types accepting some post types you can set a comma separated list of custom post types which you don't want to edit here but in this case remove this checkbox also you can filter what categories and what tags you wish to automatically edit if you want to filter out tags you can edit add here a comma separated list of tags okay so now let's save settings here we have now automatic post editing enabled and let's set what we wish to do so for example let's rewrite the content that we publish and here we will have some advanced settings and i will be going ahead and create a new post for you and we will be seeing that the plugin will rewrite its content so let us rewrite also the title as you can see that we have here ai model to use for editing we can leave this to gpt 3.5 turbo and skip post editing we can uncheck this to enable also post title editing and uh, let's change the prompt from here to for example 
translate the text to French and I will be publishing English posts now and we will be translating it to French skip post content editing and we can do this also so let's translate the text to German for the content and excerpt editing let's say we don't need excerpt editing in this case so we can leave this checkbox checked and the instruction to send for the AI editor for the excerpt is blank we have temperature top P some advanced settings and uh, maximum character chunk size we can leave these advanced settings empty and we can leave this as uh, their default values as these are also advanced settings so you can change these only if you have issues with content editing so now let's save settings and we configure the plugin to automatically rewrite using gpt 3.5 turbo and translate the title to french and translate the content to german so we can also rewrite the slugs of the post if we need it but this is optional so now let's go ahead and publish a new post wordpress themes in 2023 what will differ from now okay so this is just a quick title and let's add the same in the content for example and let's hit publish on this and we will see that the plugin published this post and it will soon automatically rewrite it also so we can wait and here it is themes in french and content in german as we set here okay so this was the automatic editing part keep in mind that you can do this for drafted or pending posts so if you save posts as draft it can the plugin can also automatically rewrite them and set them for example as publish afterwards using this little settings field okay so now let's disable this and i want to show you also that the post can be edited from wordpress post editor so for this you will have here a little button the ai yomatic ai content writer button and you will have the edit post now button which will do exactly the same as the automatic processing would do but you can do it manually for exa existing posts so if you want to edit only a single post you can go in gutenberg and click edit post now and this post will be edited by the ai editor also this will be available in classic editor as i have here a classic editor open search for aimatic ai content writer here and click edit add ai content to the post when in classic editor okay so now let's go ahead and uh, let me show you some more features so i will be moving these to trash okay and now let's create a new post similar title wordpress in 2023 news updates and features so this is an english text and let's publish it this time the plugin will not go ahead and edit this because i already disabled the automatic editing feature and i did this because i want to show you the manual editing feature this time so here we will be able to set maximum number of posts to process so this can be any value that you select but keep in mind that processing can take a while so per post the plugin can take up to three four minutes depending on the complexity of the editing that you do from here so for example if you do five posts you can expect a runtime of around 10 minutes maybe or even more so be sure to be aware of this also you can check the don't process same post twice if you don't want to edit the same post twice in the plugin also here are many many settings field that will be able to allow you to filter posts which you want to edit so be sure to set the post type to post or to the 
post type that you wish to edit and in the other settings fields select the settings that you need so you target the post that you wish to edit so i recommend category names tag names post name page id page name and many many search query is also very important this will be a search query based on a keyword that will match posts published or or active on your site so be sure to set also a post status for example if you want to only edit published posts and so on so in this case i have here the post that i mentioned so wordpress in 2023 and let's go ahead and edit it manually using this feature so i am targeting posts and this post does not have any specific so it is in the news category if i see correctly so we can go ahead and edit it okay so for this let's select an action and run editing so now this little uh, processing status will change and the green check mark appeared afterwards we can go ahead and refresh our page and the content is edited right now but we did it manually this time using the manual content editing settings so keep in mind you can change these settings as you wish and to target only the specific post that you wish to edit keep in mind also that it is recommended if you ed do bulk editing to do a backup of your site just to be sure that you don't lose any info as the ai can sometimes uh, remove parts or strip parts from the text that are not as expected so be sure of this that you make a backup of your site before you do bulk editing also here in the editing templates let me show you some other features so if we disable the ai content rewriting we can set automatic featured images from stability.ai but for this you will need to add a uh, api key in the plugin settings here in the stability ai api settings from stability.ai and we can set also royalty free image and also open ai generated image so for this we have this prompt to send to open ai or to stability.ai we have an image size and uh, yeah the plugin will automatically generate and set a featured image based on the prompt you set here and we have here short codes that you can use and the best short code to use is the post title which will be replaced by the post title and you can write a high detail photograph of post title okay afterwards we have ai generated content which will be appended or prepended to the text you can set the prompt that will be used also multiple short codes will be available here based on post title and post content and many more create content minimum char character count you can set the minimum length of the created content in characters also be sure to set if you want to append or prepend the text to the already existing post content maximum number of related headings to add ai model for heading generator and many more options you can also set images to be added to the content using maximum number of related images so you can automatically add images for example to the post content to the beginning or the end of it and also add a related youtube video if you check this checkbox so multiple options will be available to make your content more rich and uh, useful also you can add internal links automatically if you enable these settings maximum number of internal links to add to the content you can add also ranges for example three four internal links and a random number will be selected from this range and post types where to generate inbound links is will be able to be set here a comma separated list of post types can be set here automatically add comments you can add a number of comments to the post defined here this will be the prompt which will be sent this will be the previous comments shortcode can be used here in the prompt and this 
number of comments will be added to the previous comments shortcode so if the post already has some comments on it the previous comments shortcode can be used to add this context also to the ai writer in the prompt for the prompt generator you can set the model comment username list email list and url list if they if you want this but these are optional now let's go and check the ceo meta description generator so here you will be able to set a prompt and the model and the plugin will automatically uh, generate a ceo meta description for the post and this is a cool feature as if you have any of uh, your ceo plugins or all-in-one ceo plugin or rank math ceo plugin then this feature will be automatically integrated with these ceo plugins and the plugin will be able to generate meta descriptions for posts and integrate that meta description into these ceo plugins if you don't have these ceo plugins the aimatic plugin will be able to automatically add the meta description to posts on its own so the meta tag will be added by aimatic in this case also there will be this extra feature of which i already talked to change post status after editing so these are the editing options and templates and here in the advanced ai api settings we can select the model to be used maximum token prompt token result token continue token and temperature top pre presence penalty and frequency penalty so these are advanced settings i recommend you leave them at their default values only edit them if you need them okay so these are the options for ai content editor keep in mind that these options might change over time and they might get more detailed and more features might get added to them so be sure to write to read also this tutorial from here the tutorial tab which might cover the changes which will be added in the future also so this is all for this video i hope it will be helpful for you if you have more questions let me know in the comments like share subscribe it's really appreciated this is all for today bye bye